Scott Bywood here, and I want to talk about why those 101 best headlines don't actually work. <laughs> and, uh, you know, like if you Google it, you know, if you, if you go on Google and you look up 101 best headlines, you'll see some great headlines that have worked in the past. And this this um, actually came to me recently because I did a post and I was talking about. You can look it up on on LinkedIn. It was how to write stop them headlines, and a number of people said, well. Can you actually just give us the headlines? And I was like, you can't because, and the reason you can't is because without context, without understanding the target market, how can we actually, you know, how can we actually pull that off? Because uh, you, you might say, yeah, there, might, there might be, let's say, a, a great headline. Um, they laughed when he sat down at the piano, but then he started to play. Okay, and so that headline taps into particular emotions of where you, know, you want to prove other people wrong. You want to, um, you know, you want to sort of have that impact. You want to make a difference. You want to, you know, you want to sort of be the star. Um, it taps into that sort of that that disbelief in yourself. It taps into all these emotions. But you might be selling something completely different, um, where those emotions. Don't factor into what you're doing. So it's all in the context. And the best thing I can recommend if you really want to write great headlines is do your research, send out surveys, understand your clients. In many cases, you've already done the work because you already have a fairly deep understanding of your clients. But think of them. Think of the conversation going on in your customer's mind and work from that. And that's how you write killer headlines. Now then go back to the 101 best headlines for inspiration. But start by understanding your market. Thanks for tuning in. If you've enjoyed this video, then hit the like button and uh, leave a comment. And head across to scottbywood.com where I share regular you know, tips and strategies on how to maximize the return on investment from your marketing budget. I look forward to seeing you over there.